Uh, Sean Gavin wants to know what do you do if inventory is scarce in your city? Hmm. So one thing you got to be open to uh, traveling. You know, this is one of those things where it's, you know, mobile home investing is is not as um, should I say the competition is not a lot, but at the same time um, it's it's really spread out. Mobile investing is very spread out. You know, you might it, it'll be good to see that if you see you know five mobile home parks in a, in one city or sometimes you do have communities like in florida that have in one city over 70 mobile home communities so it really it really really depends you know if you're willing to travel you know mobile homes is an option and i tell people as well you know mobile homes on land is, is a whole nother option if you buy your own land you get your land developed you place a modular or mobile home on that you know now you can actually compete with houses in the area you can comp those and then still offer a little bit of margin, but let's say the houses are selling for 175,000, you can sell that mobile home on land that three bedroom for 125, 130,000. So you just really want to give yourself options. Wow, you want to leave the door open because you just don't know. That makes sense. Cool, cool. Teresa wants to know: Are mobile and modular homes the same thing? Good question. <laughs>